So recently I watched Terminator 2 again, and it got me thinking. Now, this is just a stupid fan theory, but I believe that this theory will explain all the time travel paradoxes in Terminator. Now, my fan theory is this. John Connor is, in fact, Skynet. Now, let me elaborate. I believe that John Connor, at some point in the future, realizes the predestination paradox in the, that is inherent in time travel. And thus, he himself would have to create four Terminators in order to prevent Skynet's timeline. Which means John Connor would have to research robotics, time travel, and AI. I know it sounds far-fetched for a guy who spent most of his life with military training. But it helps explain the paradoxes, as I, I think, anyways. Now, John Connor builds Terminator 1. Sends it back into the past it, with false memories of the Sky Knight timeline. This Terminator is, in fact, brand new. He recently just built it. He sent it back in time with the Skynet timeline memories in order to, quote-unquote, kill his mother. Terminator number two. That is actually, in fact, Kyle Reese. Kyle Reese has never been human, in fact. Kyle Reese is an entirely cybernetic organism of John Connor's creation with one half of his genetic code inside of his biological parts. In other words, John Connor created his own father, gave Kyrie's false memories, because he's half-machine, therefore he could be programmed with false memories of the Skynet timeline, sent him back into time so that he could inseminate his mother so that he could come into existence in order to prevent the Skynet timeline. Terminator number three is the liquid metal Terminator John Connor created in order to set up the events of Terminator 2. And finally, Terminator number four, the final Terminator, is the one that he went in order to prevent Judgment Day from happening. This is all so that he could close any time loops or any paradoxes created by his own, what he believes to be t Skynet, but in fact, John Connor is responsible for all the events of Terminator 1 through 2. He himself is in fact Skynet. He created the Terminators. There was no Skynet ever. Period. That's my fan theory, is that John Connor is in fact Skynet. He created all four Terminators. Thus creating a perfect circular loop in time travel without any paradoxes. Now... How believable is this? Eh, I don't know, but this is just what I think would explain all the loops. Is that in fact John Connor graded four Terminators? Uh, I don't know about Terminator 3 or Genesis, but it explains one and two's paradoxes. Essentially, John Connor created the Terminators in order to prevent Skynet, when in fact he was Skynet all along creating the Terminators. That's my fan theory anyways. So if you like it, tell me. If not, I'm I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm, I'm sorry.